My name is Karim Abul Nag and I'm a junior at Cornell University. As the child of two entrepreneurial Egyptian parents who did not complete high school, learning the principles of management was more important than getting good grades in school. In 2007, when my father died with no economic safety net, everything changed. To pay for his funeral, we sold our house and moved into a two-bedroom apartment as a family of six. When I reflect upon my childhood, I realize that my misfortune was truly a blessing in disguise. Undoubtedly, it was the support I received that allowed me to persevere through the adversity and aspire to pay it forward. As the first in my family to graduate high school and attend college, I understand how fortunate I am and have continuously tried to increase opportunities for those who come after me. At 19, I organized a group of friends to found Practice Makes Perfect, a nonprofit devoted to providing poor and struggling youth with mentorship and academic resources that are beyond the reach of their inner city schools. Practice Makes Perfect has the capacity to provide meaningful, cost-effective educational intervention in hundreds and perhaps thousands of inner city classrooms. Throughout my life, I have welcomed the chance to give back to my community. In addition to playing football in high school, I held multiple jobs ranging from candy salesman to lifeguard to help support my family. I'm an advocate for the Life Foundation, a nonprofit that educates people on life insurance, through which I have had the opportunity to share my family's story with millions of people to prevent them from making the same mistakes we did. At Cornell, I mentor a 10-year-old boy through Big Brothers and Big Sisters, and as co-chair of Black Students United, I'm helping to found a mentorship program to address the 73% black male graduation rate. All my life, I have avoided social pressure towards drugs and violence, and I'm determined to acquire the education needed to support my family and serve as an example for others. My goal is to one day craft legislation that will help disadvantaged children succeed in the classroom and society. The Pearson Prize will be instrumental in alleviating a financial burden and allowing me to continue working as a catalyst for change that sees the world not for what it is, but for what it could be.